this month I've been talking a lot about metatarsalgia, which is pain at the ball of the foot, and a collapse of the metatarsal arch, which is that arch at the ball of the foot, uh, that is a, lo a lot of times the cause of that pain. So today I will talk about how you can determine if you do have a metatarsal arch collapse. First, you can look at your toes to see if there's any clawing involved like this. That can be an indication. Uh, if that clawing also has, is accompanied by maybe those, these tendons here at the ball of the foot, if they're stringing out, that can be another indication. You can also look at the bottom of the foot. So you want to see if there's any collapse through here. If there is a bit of a cave there, that looks good. But if the pad is completely flat or there's a bit of a bump at the ball of the foot, that is an indication that the the arch has collapsed. Um, that might also indicate that there has been some fat pad shift. So if there's a lot of bulk right around this area instead of under the ball of the foot, that could indicate that the fat pad has shifted to the front instead of right underneath the ball of the foot. If you have any further questions about metatarsalgia, feel free to reach out and I would be happy to help.